Do you know if you are a GBN driver or the operator in Atlanta, Georgia, you can make $1,000 in less than eight hours driving time? Let's go find out. What is up my truckers? Good morning and welcome to ML Trucking. Today is a, today it's Saturday morning. It's 6 o'clock in the morning. Alright guys, now I'm at the um, Palmero, JBN Yard. Pick up my first load going to uh, Whirlpool, McDonough, Georgia. And this load gonna pay uh, $212 or $221. Not bad. It's only 37 miles. Uh, if you are a Jibian driver, you already know Palmetto Yard, which is Geo. Uh, it's not that far. It's like 37, 36, 37 miles. So we're gonna pick up this load and go ahead and drop it at the pool in McDonough, Georgia. Get another load in McDonough, which is at Jenko. Go down to Atlanta, to the World Yard in Atlanta. And after that, we are going to get another load and see where things go and i'm gonna show you today i'm gonna demonstrate how we can make a thousand dollars in less than eight hours driving time so let's do it let's make it happen guys please enter your trailer number followed by the pound key <laughs> As you can see guys, now we just, we live on um, Palmero. I'm on my way to McDonald, Georgia. And this is what you need to understand. You don't need to drive fast in order for you to make money as a city driver. Uh, I had a friend sometimes ask me, oh, so what speed, what the speed limit of my truck? I mean, I'll be like 70 and I'd be like, man, be speeding i'll be like no i don't even push the truck no more than 62 60 55 miles an hour as a city driver you don't need to like kill yourself trying to drive fast otherwise you're gonna you're gonna be in big trouble and make yourself look like a very careless driver because you're a city driver and those people that surrender you they don't even know what they're doing you don't want that be that's supposed to be looking out out for you, your truck, and people in the world. Like make sure that you stay safe um, all the time. This is why most drivers that drive local they don't understand that they always on the airway. They trying to pass you, and when you get to the traffic light, you see the same truck that just passed you like two three minutes like ago. And um, yeah, I think. Being a city driver give you, I mean, make you become a person that um, you you have more patience because you have to deal with all those people in the city. And yeah, being a city driver is a good thing. It's changed your life. For me, just a lifestyle. Okay, guys, we now arrived to uh, our first delivery in McDonough, Georgia, where pool, McDonough, Georgia. This way we're gonna do our first drop for today. And this load pay um I think this would pay 200 and 212. I'm gonna let you know when I drop it. So it's not bad. After that, I'm gonna go ahead to um, Jenko, pick up another load going back to Atlanta. And, um, yep. I have to go inside to um, do the paperwork and stuff. <laughs> Let's go ahead and go inside and see what's up here. Okay, guys. Um, we got our paperwork. We're good to go, it's clear to drop. 
So let's go ahead and drop this. Let's go ahead and find an empty spot to drop this box and try to see if we can find an empty to go to Jenko to pick up as our second second load for the day and make $400 for so far and move from there and see if we can't make a thousand dollars today that's the goal the goal today is to make a thousand it's easy you know i'm gonna show you that i'm gonna take you out you see the way i take you out today i'm gonna show you how easy it is to like make a thousand dollars um peace out bro I'm just looking for an empty spot in this area do I don't like doing some backing maneuver. I'm trying to see if I can just do a... There we do. I've had one. This is what I like doing. I like go all the way around and just turn myself. Yeah. When I fight like open a wide open space like this i don't i don't kill myself doing some backing maneuver it's like it's not worth it you see the way the way the the box is going straight to the line follow the line i'm just following the line and make it go smooth with the side you see this Nice and easy. You don't have to kill yourself trying to do a lot of maneuver. You see this? It saves you time. It's safer. You see this? Not even like two minutes. Um, trying to get empty back there. Okay. Gloves sitting here. I gotta go slow, slow motion. Let me see if I can release the air. Let's go down. Woo, guys, it's freezing. It's like 27 today. It's so cold. You see this thing going out nice and easy. You see this? So now let me go back there to see if I find an empty and if we can find an empty that will be good I can take it to Jenko. Jenko is right there it's like three to four miles down the street oh I see I don't know if it's empty or not let me go back there and see. Because nowadays it's really hard to find a JB and empty in this area. Um, if I don't find one, that would, it's okay. I can just bobtail there. I know this particular customer. It's a uh, yeah, Jenko. It's not a problem at all. To bobtail to Jenko. Well, hopefully I find one. Let me see. Yeah, this is empty. Let me grab that. This is one thing of, of having a day cab. You see this thing, big thing so easy for you. Thing so, so much easy. This is the thing of having a day cab though, big thing so much easy. I gotta double check to make sure that it's really empty before I even start the plug. Yes, it's empty. Woo! Okay. This is the thing of working the weekend. The weekend, it's you see these tires? This is gone. I need to replace it. Uh, I don't think it's gonna give me more than 
probably a week but uh, sometimes this week i'm gonna have it replaced i'm gonna stop driving after uh, tomorrow I might, I might be driving but after tomorrow i'm gonna be off because i like saturday and sunday a lot you make so much money and easy on a short period of time like no traffic nothing i'm gonna have it And this is what we do. We um this is the bit of the signs and the date and everything. We're gonna send the unloading call and order for them to um 